next step. Gloves. I'm overburdened. Stone, but not ancient shadow. Aw, oh, man. Faith smile. Don't forget, luck always changes. Five. Like you could use a more father would be proud of you. Nine. Wow. Only it was ancient and stuff. Five or fifty one. Oh, defensive. I'm still waiting. Sweet revenge. Some fun. Oh, the goblin ran all the way over here. Guess I didn't see one. I didn't see the one that ran all the way over there. Saw the gold. That shadow boots ancient is the question. Couldn't see it in the IDing. Nope. In 
fact, it can't stop giving me the Cinder Coat Ancients. I don't need Cinder Coats anymore. Wasn't a power pylon yet, so ask. My name is Earth. When it's down, I am still the Caravan Dragon. All right, so it's a 125. Failed. That one succeeded. Back. Still fail. Okay, succeeded. What do I do? Oh, where was the gem that I was working on? lower side so whenever I do too low I have to work on the gems that are even lower aka the ones between 0 to 125 Aw, oh, come on. The one time it's ancient again, it's a 4.5, not a 6. I need a 6. Ah. Uh, I need a 6, not a 4.5 here. Probably need some newer gems to work with for the lower GRs. Those maps were terrible. That's why it wasn't even under 330. What are these ancient cinder coats trying to do in my inventory space? Is that ancient? Nope. But it's 2010 and physical. Wow. They tried again. They're like... You're looking for both ancient shadow gloves and helmet six. Well, we're gonna keep trying to give it to you. Well, thanks for trying. You look like you could use a new item. New thing. What? My pack is full. I didn't even know I had that thing. Well, Kadala isn't. At least the GRs are trying. Look at that. Kadala isn't trying. It's like. Oh, the GRs are giving you the exact thing? Well, I guess you can just look for the GR instead, right? You don't need me. Something on this side? Nope. Okay. Ah, they 
face shielded. Okay. They're like, you have a shield and power. It's too powerful. Our shields are breaking down. Dead. And I'll just keep swapping between them. Okay. You have proven yourself worthy of the gift of Never ancient Vala anymore. So day 3.5, that's the bare minimum that I want. In for Still non ancient. Exact. Ah, it's perfect for the monk. The 8 CDR one. Okay. So, um, last time I, the way I did it was, it was Blue Fallen specific. And it was Pylon Order most of the way that got me there. So, I need Pylon help for sure. And then I need under 3k or 3k plus. Because where I'm sitting is too low. And then I have to find out if... If there's another like mob set that works for me. Got a primal focus, crit crit damage range. Oh, you already had one. Well, I mean, every little bit helps. But yeah, I I wish I got something like that. I need a restraint that's, you know, actually better shifting it up for the whirlwind barb okay I mean yeah I mean like you can just push with you can just push it with either or really I mean If you can consistently get 150 gems, you just work on one, and then when you finish working on one push, you just be off to the other side. Or, or what you could do is just aug it with vitality, right? And then, you know, then you can just don't need the 200 paragons in the DH side, right? If the DH side still had vitality on the paragon side, then you can just don't do anything and then you can use a vitality one for both 
and that's what that's what uh H Crypt does. He puts vitality on like gear that he uses on multiple classes that you know that has a requirement of base vitality in the paragons. And so when it makes it forces him to put too much paragons into vitality. Well, I mean, you can just split this, yeah, split it to both. Both. I mean, when you play that much, you're bound to have multiples. You have a dream. I mean, I've played so much this season that I've gotten two primal focus rings that I've never gotten like jewelry, more or less primal, or rings especially. So I've played more than I used to, even though I've taken as many bricks as I have already as well. But this is the highest paragon I've done because I've just managed to um, actually consistently do 125s. Become stronger. Ah, socketed travelers, but it's not ancient. One sixty four, nope. Sixty seven, nope. <laughs> Physical. They they want they want me to play a Barb physical build or something. I know I pulled a yellow, but my progress bar is almost there. Just need 1% somewhere. I mean, that's the thing. In terms of practicing still, gotta watch the percentage. Just because it speeds doesn't mean you don't look. Yay, get for me. Only issue I have personally at a monk. Oh, that? Huh. That for uh for for uh H crypt was is the EU side. For me yesterday I'm not sure. Yesterday it felt like there was something like that as well, but it was more the shadow clones not being near me. Because I was not dealing, like, damage, period. You have proven yourself worthy. How satisfying. Which basically says that the rabbit strike isn't even doing its job, so... It's like, why use it? Six, what a steal. three of fifty four, and Kadala is not very friendly today. Fortune favors the bold, right? I didn't even know I had that thing. Three of seventy two. 
of course it's easy now, but like, I always seem to play better. In the majority that happens, when there's like more elite packs, I generally play better, unless it's like really difficult. Like, when there's like three or five ground affixes combined, then obviously it's too difficult. But like, when there's like more elite packs than one, I play better. Okay, nice. Then again, like, sometimes I try to avoid playing the builds that make you move too much. Because then you're not actually doing enough. Or at least for me, I don't like it. And when I say moving too much, I mean like when you're fighting one on one and you're still moving that much, unless you're hurting, that's different. Then it's player error. Whereas if it's like a lower run and the shield affix eats the time of the average time That's just stupid Hit zero keys on Friday. Well, yeah. But then they follow you. The minions follow you, though. So if it's a yellow elite, and the yellow elite's a shield, they follow you. So you have to kill it. That's the that's the annoying side about the pushing side of it. But um, you hit zero keys on Friday. Wow. Yeah, I don't. I don't want to purposely get all the way down to that. That pair tried. What are these intelligence rolls? Like, I had some intelligence drops there just now, and it intelligence witch doctor. Wow, I just got a hundred one. That's cool. I just got a hundred all res one. I got a 99 somewhere in here. There, I got a 99. I got a hundred one. Raps didn't go through even after. It 
because the target got killed. And that's another reason why previously, before I got too used to doing um, generator even for my EXP run, the, uh, the reason why you don't do generator is because when the wraps doesn't work like that, you get proc for like that very reason. So speeds generally without needing wraps is better because of that. Because then you actually get enough damage reduction from Elusive Ring that you don't have to care about whether reps works or not. Puzzle ring. Shadow gloves. Bad. But it's still bad. What is your credit chance on your monk? I mean, if you're like around 46 without gloves, you can do 80, I think. Going below 45. Crit is really bad. I wouldn't go past 45 crit. Like, past below 45 crit hit chance. But, your what is your AD? Like, are you be like, are you like below one ten still? only downside to this staircase is that not only they have shielded monster sh the, the, the ones that give the shield the angle of the stairs is bad for fighting like this specific mob set Yeah, 
this Corvus is terrible. Oh yeah, when you when you start using multiple gear, especially Squirt's necklace. To spend. I am returning to town. Need to spend. but it's not ancient. Ah, yeah. I see. So that's a problem. Yeah, so, normally speaking, like, the... <sighs> oh yeah, because the crit damage is increased, because, because uh, CFD is also increased from... Yeah, so that's why it's above it, but it is AD for you, unfortunately, because you need that 110. The problem is I wouldn't play below 45 crit hit chance. That's the problem. But that's my issue, because whenever I go past 50, and then I start dropping lower and lower, it really sucks. Because then the ratio of the crit damage is so high. Right? And that's why it's crit chance over crit damage, because of the ratio. Even on after I spend, I'll show you where I'm at with my monk. And my monk has the issue of the crit chance being a problem. I'm not at door 42 point something though, but I fell. Like I fell below 50% and I generally don't like going below 50%, but uh, for like the LOD builds, you tend to fall below 50% pretty easily. But you're also like a little like too far below but I think you have no choice that's the that's why I say a rock in a hard place
Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you're short and qualified, it's always a toss up, and that's the and that's the part, and that's also, and and that's also another reason why. Uh, a lot of people use stone gauntlets in a really weird way is because the RNG of stone gauntlets is so terrible that it also affects the LOD builds a lot because of how random it rolls and so the 50% often drops really below par yeah the the create damage is ridiculously stupid um on the especially the monk because it's you know two one-handers and then on top of it the rabbit strike has the extra bit as well so it's all th that's why the priority is create chance over create damage because the create damage is always gonna be there your ratio is hardly ever going to match up so you need as much credit chance wherever you can get but then the build is like cooldown and ad first so that's the problem but uh yeah my, my mug is at i think 46 or something like around 46 i mean I'm just gonna hold those for fun. Yeah, yeah, the CDR. That's like I just don't practice enough. And that's the whole reason why I don't do lower, lower speeds. Because I don't practice enough mortar already. I don't need lower speeds to cause even less of practice. And these dumb fights. Like the the missiles that the skeleton king drops. Yeah, I I I'm just so bad at dodging it that if I play the monk, first of all the monk has serenity. Second of all, the monk plays up close anyway. But then like if you play Shadow Impale, you are playing from range. I'm supposed to be good good at and, and the build is specifically moving, so I'm bad at countering the Skeleton King's missiles. So I need even more plays. And the practice. Whereas the lower speeds is like, eh, who cares. Got some 135s out of that. Every time I see homing pads, I like while I automatically salvage them, sometimes I should watch if they're intelligence. But sometimes they drop intelligence even on your Dex class. Like dropping a strength crusader, fifteen percent smite strings. <laughs> Just for example.
guess not. Oh, there it is. That's what I was looking for. Oh, spinners. Yay. Cold snap. Nice. Both those are now 136. Getting closer to my other spurs. Thank you for coming. There are not ancient reps. Bad. And when I when am I gonna get a better restraint? Aside from gambling things, two. No gift. Right. Do I want to upgrade? Find a use for that. Send it. See what happens. Shall what we? a steal. What? I didn't even know I had that thing. Don't be shy. What? I didn't even know I had that thing. Fate smiles on you. See you soon. See you soon. Wow. Four of seventy-two. Today, Kadala is just not giving legendaries. 